All right, welcome to another edition of Energy Can Man. We got new, uh, well, not new really, but the uh, Blue Edition Red Bull Blueberries. Um, somehow, I don't know how I do it, but I get stuck in like a little series of things. Got kind of last week, we can have it's been like the Celsius brand. I might throw something different in there, but here lately, I've been doing a lot of blueberry flavored energy drinks. And uh, I just so happened to saw this one. I was like, I checked for my video and ain't done this one. I said, well, I reckon we'll have to do a uh, Red Bull uh, Blueberry Edition. Red Bull Blue Edition. I don't know how that goes. But all right. Taste the blueberries. Uh, let's crack this bad boy. Oh, yeah, see the top. I wonder, I'm not really sure what there are two little dimples up here. Or nipples, whatever you want to call them. Crack the bad boy here. Woo, boy, that smells like blueberry pancakes, yeah. And it comes out like that purplish blue, like a real blueberry. I gotta give it that on credit on that one. I guess we got the. Mm. Oh, this that's really good. It's got like a little sourness there to it in like a kind of like you eat a whole bunch of strawberry i mean not strawberry, blueberries at one time hmm all right let's see what we got on the back of this bad boy here calories 160 total fat zero sodium 140 which is actually not bad for a actual really good sugary energy drink uh total carbohydrate 41 grams which that is kind of a lot uh the total sugars is 38 and all added 38 sugars so like i said they do have a lot of sugar in the red bulls which is normal after they're still kind of the still big name brand that has a lot of sugar in their energy drink. Uh, nine cents 140 percent, B12 is 120 percent, uh, B6 is 350 percent. Why is way more B6 than uh, B12? That's usually different, and that's all we got on now. The caffeine content. And for some reason, Red Bull, when they put a 12 ounce one, it's a uh, different than 114 milligram for a 12 fluid ounce. And which is that's kind of where they stick on with the um, with the 12 ounce cans for Red Bulls. So I don't know if you call know they put sugar in it or what. Uh, a cool little thing here. Like I said, that they come from California. I was telling a guy I work today, like a lot of these come from, from California. I don't know what's up with energy drinks in California, what they got going on over there. But uh, this is also made in Switzerland, 1996 and 2013. So. I don't know that California might outsource the uh, to other countries. Uh, from what I'm seeing in here is the outsource the brand. I don't know that for the can. That's the product and it's shipped over here. Probably cheaper. But, and it's that's really, really good. Wow. Uh, well, I ain't going to make it for too long on this one here. Uh, stay tuned. Like I said, on this Monday morning here, I'm going to go back and I'm going to do a... a for like last week video, I didn't get a chance to do it this weekend. My wife's birthday, you know, you gotta do that kind of, gotta do the man thing on that one. So, you know, I'll get around to doing it day when I get off work. But, uh, all right, tasting, man, the taste, smell, and the color, I mean, everything, I mean, it's a real good solid 10 on that, man. I gotta give it that on that one. Now, the energy level and the caffeine, these Red Bull are using pretty good. Uh, I'm going to put them at like an 8.5. Like I said, it, it, you do get a good rush off of them, but then you kind of crash and burn there at the end with these. That's the only thing I don't care about Red Bull about. But, uh, and that's why I kind of do like the uh, sugar-free one. They don't make you crash as bad. But uh, that's all I got on this uh, Red Bull Blueberry Edition. I know this probably been out for a while. But like, like I said, I'm kind of stuck in doing blueberry videos here right now. And then, so I thought I'd do a video on that. That's all I got for y'all today. I said stay tuned. Like I said, there'll be definitely more content coming. Other than that, stay on the grind, y'all.